When we're talking about brain cancer, of course, we're talking about primary brain cancer, like gliomas, all the types of gliomas, and secondary brain cancer, when metastases are infiltrating the brain. So usually when we talk about brain cancer, we're talking about gliomas, different types, and unfortunately, there's been very little progress in curing patients with brain gliomas. The standard of care is usually surgery when surgery can be done safely, radiation therapy to block progression of residual malignant cells, and chemotherapy, usually a drug used, uh, temozolomide or temodal, which is very convenient because it's an oral medication, usually administered five days every month. Unfortunately, this treatment, which is the standard of care all over the world, is not enough. It does not cure patients. It slows the disease progression, it extends life expectancy, but does not cure. In order to cure brain gliomas, treatment must be much, much smarter and much more effective. In our opinion, we have to combine and synergistic anti-cancer modalities, the more the better, in order to control brain gliomas that are otherwise incurable. And what I mean is, for example, oncolytic viruses that can attack and kill cancer cells despite resistance to chemotherapy. The oncolytic viruses can also induce immunity against cancer cells because they change the phenotype of cancer cell. The immune system that ignores normally the cancer cell, when it will see viral antigens of the malignant cell, it will attack because it is already something foreign. And the immune system always attacks uh, against any, any foreign invader. Uh, the other modalities which could be effective, which uh, we are now using, is photodynamic therapy. Photodynamic therapy is based on the use of toxic oxygen radicals that can damage the cancer cells. And this can happen even against cancer cells that are drug resistant. In addition, of course, immunotherapy, using all the modalities we have, both the checkpoint inhibitors and additional modalities, sometimes interferon, sometimes interleukin-2, and sometimes additional agents that amplify the anti-cancer effects of available checkpoint inhibitors or lenalidomide or valproic acid or different agents that when combined can induce synergistic anti-cancer effects.